Welcome back, everybody. We got ourselves another episode of Judge Jamma as we prepare ourselves for some swift and needed justice. Banana slam jam. Looks like we've got a naughty morphling griefing as the reported player, a reporting party, shall I say, has declared. Let's check this out. He is two and two. Nothing too crazy. He was a mid morphling. They're not having the best game. He tipped his carry when he died. That's not exactly what I would call polite. Looks like according to gameplay, he's doing everything pseudo normal here. I keep fast forwarding. It looks like he's gonna die to Earthshaker OD. Oh, and there it is. I'd say wicked sick. Judge Jamma has seen the case. Verdict guilty. Can you do, man? What can you do? On to the next one, Morphling, as you enjoy your time in the hypothetical online jail that is called whatever we where, where, wherever we send you wherever we send you okay so we got ourselves a mars that has been reported for feeding two and ten that is an awful lot of deaths how far back can we rewind here looks like he's got some pseudo normal items he was against what looks like Either a Jug Ogre or a Ogre Anti-Mage. If you were to get left alone, that would be a hard lane. He's going to go back to base and get some manners. He's going to come back out. He's playing the game. He's going for the team fight. You know, that spear, it was really close. As this ring does have a nice passive, it does give intelligence as well as mana regen. Yules is himself instead of the. Okay. Gotta wait till he's alive again. 30 seconds in. 30 seconds in counting. What's he gonna do with it? They're down by 20k. It's time to slam jam. Let's go. Thank you, ma'am. Wham, bam. Let's go, Mars. He's ready to play. Gets his Shadow Shaman Abyssal. Tries to save him with the spear, but just doesn't. Quite have the juice, or shall I say, gas in the tank. As all I see here is somebody who tried their best and it just didn't work out. So I shall submit that with a not guilty, my friend. Not guilty. Justice is carried out in many ways, guys. Many ways. And it is just as important that we declare innocent those who have been prosecuted. While we also fuck up the morphlings of the world, you know what I'm saying? Okay, next one. Got ourselves a Marana offlane. Not a good start. Not a good start. Feeding. So this Marana offlane is six and seven. I mean, that's not too crazy. Let's see what he's going to do here. They're down by 10k. Game is not ideal. Looks like he's playing... Okay, he's playing, he survives, he built the fusel against Wraith King Void, that makes sense. Looks like he had to mute his team, maybe report them as well, I'm not sure. The Alchemist who went Brown Boots Radiance, probably the guy that reported him, let's be honest. It's probably the one in six Alk with Brown Boots Radiance that reported him. It's understandable. So we shall declare this a fresh, not guilty verdict. As it must be understood that just by picking a hero and not necessarily having high impact does not make you a griefer or a feeder. <sighs> Alchemist players, they think they own the world just because they get more money from the same amount of things that we do. GG, man. We got a Wraith King in the safe lane that is feeding. 
That is level two at five minutes. Oh, and four. Can we rewind here? What is the explanation? He's against Pudge Tusk. I'm guessing the beginning of this game was somehow a lot of hooks into tag team. And then he's literally jungling as he dies. That's a bit sus. What does he do now? He's going to walk back to lane with the boots. Strategical purchase here. He's now walking back to lane and dying again. He TP's in. He's literally jungling as he dies. A few moments later. <laughs> there's actually so many clips, and usually when there's this many clips, it's like his teammates bitching or something. He's actually died in every single one of these, at least once. What the fuck? Oh, 17! <laughs> He's actually died in all of these! As I will give that a guilty verdict as walking into a jungle camp and dying to a tusk as he's hitting you when you're jungling, I would consider that to be feeding. I actually can't believe how many times he died, that's crazy. I actually have to call that feeding. That's the first time that we've had to agree with the feeding verdict. Usually the feeding verdict is people just pissed off that their teammates dying a lot. That guy was legitimately feeding. That was that was an experience, guys. I'm glad whoever was here live got to be there with me and whoever's watching on YouTube got to experience this. May may not be at the same time as me, but we got to experience it as one as we got a lion support who's griefing. Skill build not looking so hot. Dyer's top tower is under attack. Well, the funny thing is, is that in that last one, it felt like we had to see a lot of examples, right? Why is it not letting me submit the... In the last one, we had to see a lot of examples. It felt like maybe his team was a bit upset based on the sheer number of clips that were submitted in order to, you know, accuse him of his feeding. In this game... We only needed the one clip. That's all we needed. That was ample enough information for us to rule guilty here. So we went from one that required 20 consecutive clips of feeding into just one. And that works. That works very nicely. It's very nice. As is that it for the day? Have we done our job? Looks like we've done our job for the community. One little day of reviews at a time thank you everyone who's experienced this with me and uh lion you know we have a lot of guilty verdicts on this set and that's okay because that's what people want to see that's for the content boys easy content we are indeed doing our civic duty thanks for watching everybody make sure you like subscribe all that kind of shit that usually my youtube editor just puts like a a stock film piece of me doing and it looks like i'm in this same shirt every day at the end of the video but today you'll be in the same shirt that i had in the entire video